Hello everyone and welcome back to RuneScape. Today we're going back to the past again to free another person from Recipe for Disaster. We still have most of this side of the table left, plus of course Scratch over there, but today we're going to do the Lumberge Sage because it's an easier one. How can I help the Lumberge Sage? Well, what better way to help the Lumberge Sage than a cake of guidance? Would you like to help? Can I just say no and then let someone else do it? Uh, I'll do it. Yes, I'm sure I can make a cake. Sounds a bit weird though. What does it involve? Well, I'm not too familiar with the fine details. You'll have to go and speak with Treyborn in the Wizard's Tower. He'll know what you need. Okay, thanks. I'll get right on it. Alright, so yeah, we just gotta run over there real quick. I, I don't have a teleport prepared. I could have done that, but whatever. It's fine. I'll just run. So yeah, it is double XP week as I'm currently recording this episode. And I'm actually doing a bit of training on this one. I don't do that too often nowadays because I don't really care. But I'm training Dungeoneering. I'm going to get 115. We've already gone from 112 to 114. And I'm hoping I can get 115 before the old school RuneScape League starts. But if not, I'll still keep playing. I don't really know why they're having to do so many different things all at once this month, but they are. Got Vorkath coming out soon. So much going on. Got We're apparently getting a Christmas quest this year, which will be nice. Looking forward to that. But yeah, I, I'm not enjoying the Dungeoneering grind, but it's not too bad either, you know. Just what a handful of hours of training left. And we'll be done with 115, and I'll finally have access to the uh, Motherlode Maw, which is what I want. Anyway, where is Treyborn, anyway? I don't actually remember where he is. I can never remember where he is. I know he's kind of the crazy looking one, but uh, it doesn't really help me remember where he is, or even what floor he's on. Maybe I can just look it up uh where is he Treyborn, third floor okay so he's up one more that would explain why i didn't see him who would have guessed it all right where is he where is he up oh, that's cedridor where is he i blind apparently so there's a sleeping wizard oh I'm terrible at clicking, but we got him. Hello, young thing me what? Hi, I was wondering if you could help me. You don't look like you have a problem. Well, I do. I need to make something called a cake of guidance, and I was told that you could help me out. Mmm, cake of guidance. Yummy yum. Did you know they're imbued with knowledge and information itself? When eaten, it will give anyone the guidance they need to get back on track. So you say you're a chef? Mm, no, I don't think I did. I need to make that cake for the Lumberge Sage. He's been frozen in time and needs help. Oh dear, it's a strange day when the Lumberge Sage needs guidance. Don't worry, I shall help you make your chocolate cake. Not a chocolate cake, a cake of guidance. Make up your mind. I have, so what do I need to do? You don't know? Deary me. You'll need to enchant three ingredients with your own knowledge. Bring me the basic ingredients and I will help you with the enchantment. What are the ingredients? An eggy peggy, some flowery wowery, and some milky wilky. So, in the same world, an egg, flour, and milk. No problem, I'll be right back. Have a nice time. Thanks. And we're back. Hello, Hi. Brought any ingredients? Yes, an egg. Interesting, starting from the middle. Excellent. I can't believe you said that, so I will just pretend you didn't. Boo, hiss, you're no fun. I will need your help for the enchantment. You must imbue it with knowledge itself. You must complete a quiz to enact the enchantment. Okay, let's start. Okay, you will be presented with some people that you may have come across in your travels. It's up to you to recall their names. Guess three correctly without error and you will succeed in enchanting the egg. Alright, what are we gonna get here? Could be anything. 
Um, and it looks zombie-ish, honestly. Who is that supposed to be? Aim that person. Um, hmm. None of those are really obvious to me, so I'm just going to look it up. That would be Velarina. Is she a ghost from Ghost Ahoy? I guess so. Yeah, I can't say that's really on the top of my mind. Correct. And now for the second character. Got an egg now. Bookcase, according to the interface. Got someone I know this time. Um, I mean, obviously he's from the desert. But who is he? I don't particularly know. Is he... Um... I mean... I think it must be Ali Morrison, right? <laughs> That's the only one from the desert out of those, I think. Correct, and now the third and final character. Who do we got? We got another girl. Um, we got some muscles there, but I don't think that's really relevant. Name that person. Oh, gosh. See, I don't know what any of these characters look like off the top of my head. That's Gertrude. I thought it might be Gertrude, just because, you know, Gertrude. That's correct. That wasn't so bad. Now what? Well, there is the case of the magic words of enchantment. Repeat after me. Dandolino Zadridbrim. Dandolino Zadim. Not quite, but it'll do. I will hold on to the enchanted egg for you until you need it. You're gonna make me do this every time. Hello, Hi. Brought any ingredients? I've got some milk. Can we enchant it? Mmm, milk. By all means, you're going to have to complete a quiz first to bring forth guidance and enact the enchantment. All right, I'm ready. Okay, you must answer three general questions about our lands correctly without getting one wrong. You have as many chances as you need. What is the nearest guild to the fishing platform? As the seagull flies. Hmm. That's a tough one without looking at the map. Because it's not um, walking distance, it's flying distance. So I'm just going to look that one up. Uh, closest guild. It's Legends. Correct, good job. Two more to go. What's the name of the toy seller in Draenor Village? Oh, that's an easy one. Dango. Correct. Well done. One more to go. What ingredients are used in a cake? Well, I mean, technically, there's nothing stopping you from making a cake with any of these ingredients, but we'll probably go with the ones we're using. Correct. Well done. That's all three answered. That's correct. Now what? Repeat after me. Scalindum Ralinaplo. Skelly Dami Relipo. Close enough. The milk has now been enchanted. You're making this up, aren't you? How dare you? Now get me the next ingredient. I will hold on to the enchanted milk for you until you need it. Hello, hey, young. Hi. Brought any ingredients? I have obtained a pot of flour. So you want to enchant it now? You'll have to take active part by completing a little quiz to imbue the flower with knowledge and enact the enchantment. Quiz me. For enchanting this item, you will be shown a selection of items. When you stop viewing the selection, you'll have to answer three questions correctly in a row, and then the flower will be enchanted with guidance. All right, we got a whole bunch of items. There's actually only like five questions he can ask, so it's actually just in the guide. Which of the following items were not shown to you? I actually know this. It's a trout. I read it earlier today. <laughs> That's correct. On to the second set. Oh, yeah. Here's more items. What is it going to be? How many weapons were you shown? I don't know. Uh, you tell me. How many weapons was I shown? Three. Three weapons. Correct. And now the third and final set. Ooh, look at all these. We got a trout this time. How nice. Um, which items? Guthix Prayer Book is the option. 
That's correct. And that's it? You have to repeat the magic words, of course. Oh, of course. Splendidum Romelno. Spindidum Romeo. We shall make a wizard of you yet. I will hold on to the enchanted flower for you until you need it. Um, I kind of need it now. So I've enchanted all three ingredients now? Indeed, best you go bake the cake. You can do it the same way as making an ordinary cake. Thank you. All right, let's head on back to Lumbridge then. Yeah, this is a nice and quick quest. I'm kind of trying to take out the easy ones right now since there's so many things going on. You know, trying to train in all sorts of different ways. So we're just gonna take care of the easy ones that... Easy ones that still don't affect my Dominion Tower plans in case I still want to do it, you know? We're holding off on ruining that until I absolutely have to. But it probably will be soon. Very, very soon. Alright, how do we cook this exactly? Is it an other recipe? Or a cake? Or do I just use the ingredients on it? Maybe I just use the ingredients on it. Oh, maybe I need to combine them. That might help. No? Um. Huh. Who would have guessed that this would be the hardest part? What do we do here? Uh. Huh. Let me see what the guide says. Use all three green. Okay, you have to use it on the cake tin, apparently. All right, I just didn't do the correct clicking thing. There we go, a cake of guidance. It looks tasty. I would eat it. Although it probably has Blizzard Treyborn's germs on it. And then I guess we just use it on him, right? That's probably what we do. And there we go. Another thing complete. We got two treasure hunter keys. Woohoo. Nobody cares. But we got a little bit of XP. Good work, adventure. I've teleported them away to safety. You only have three council members left to protect. I thought about doing this one today, but I really didn't feel like hunting jubblies or whatever. It just didn't seem like something I felt like doing, so I didn't do it. Yeah, I guess we can hop on over here and look at what new things we have available in the Colon Necromancer's chest. I did have to buy a bunch of things from here in the past. It was kind of annoying. Yeah, but look at all these things we have. I think it increases the amount of stock that you get for the food, but I don't think it affects the stock for these. It just gets you another tier. So we didn't have this tier before, probably. We didn't check, but I assume that's the case. But yeah, so that is another one complete. Uh, I don't know for sure what quest we'll be doing next. I haven't really decided. There's a few options. And uh, I'll figure it out. But uh, I think Vorkath is coming up soon. Is that next week? I can't remember if that's next week. Whatever week it comes out, we're doing that right away. I think it has a quest coming with it too, actually, which I didn't know for sure, but they did mention a quest. Unless they're just talking about the quest that came out last month. I really have no idea what's going on, to be honest. But uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next week for whatever we end up doing next. And if it's Vorkath, that'll be good. Bye.